And here. Oh, 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 oh my god, there's oh, shit go. everywhere. Oh, oh, okay. okay. So oh, 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 I went to school for this. And also, here's on that one. No, 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 she's fine. She's pushy. Cheers! Here is to the end of a horrible, deep, dark shithole! I said not tonight. Katie isn't gonna go for it. This is our last night to be young and stupid. Oh. So go being a girl. What do you think I'm trying to do? Hmm. Drug dealers deliver. Outside of Crazy Town, population one. Fine. You were dreaming about the Bachelor, right? Did you get the rose? You know I hate that show. <laughs> oh come on! You don't have that dream. Weird. No, what's weird is you kidnapping me for the weekend. That's what's weird. Oh yes, I totally kidnapped you. Don't guilt tripping me. It's just as bad. I haven't seen you in months. No one has. I'm busy, Mel. Nobody's that busy, JoJo. I've had tons of auditions and appearances to do, and I still make time for my friends. Are you going to tell me where we're going? Thank you. 
Oh no. <laughs> oh yes. Home now. Not today, it's hard enough. Joey, it's been five years. Yeah, you don't think I know that? You never talk about it. I mean, we all went through that night together and it's... Uh, hey. We went through that night together and it's like you're trying to recover on your own. We are all moving on and I can't let you get left behind. Okay, okay, I understand that, all right? I don't want to be around everyone right now. Take me home, please. No. No. What do you mean, no? Oh, you don't know what no means? Oh, no wonder you were so popular. <laughs> oh, come on, that was funny. All right, look, I have this all planned out and I'm not gonna let you ruin it. So just look at this as being a, a Minor intervention. We need you to come back to the world! Joey, come back. We'll show you the way, baby. We have a yeah. dream. We have been to be to you. Oh. You be oh. me. I mean, look how beautiful it is out here. We can go swimming in the river out back, or we could go hiking, or we could sleep all day if you want. My mom said we could stay as long as we want. So. Oh my god, she did? She say we could stay up late too. Oh my god, till like 11. <sighs> Come on. Oh, I came all the way up here and I got it all ready and everything. Come on. Come on. All right. Thank you. And I brought Pop-Tarts. I said all right. Ooh, and hard lemonade. I'm gone. I'm kidding. <laughs> this is so unfair. You know that, right? Joey, you need this. You might not know it now, but you need this. You hear me? What I need is a glass of wine. <laughs> Where's the wine, you assholes? This way, my Sangria! Woo! No service. Fucking hell, how am I supposed to post pics? Maybe there's a Bolton from town. We can post your pics there where no one will like them either. No. Oh, well, the first pic I'm gonna take is that shitty ass macrobiotic cow puke you drink. What is this? It keeps me calm. You should be supportive, H bomb. Oh, I forgot we used to call you this. Oh, we used to call you Harry Hara. Oh, my Harry. Shut sure. up. <laughs> How many dudes has that giant bush scared off? Oh, I don't have time for dudes because my giant bush and I are just... Uh. <laughs> Here, let me help. No, no, no. Go. Relax. Scoot. Now. So, um, can you shop a little faster there, love? Oh. I'm getting thirsty. <laughs> Melissa, you look stunning in these. Oh my god, I love the one with the glasses. Are you pregnant? All right, you're not getting any of my sangria. <laughs> Sorry, I broke it. It was a show. <laughs> I was pregnant for fake. <laughs> for fake. <laughs> it was non-realism. They pulled you into this too, huh? Yeah. Well, on our plans. Yeah. Yeah. So is this the point where we ask each other how we're doing and we both lie and say we're fine? Yeah, I think so. Hi, Katie. Hi, Joey. <laughs> I'm here. Too. <laughs> Woo! All right, everybody, come All over right. here. Come, I have drinks. Woo! Sangria! Sangria! Bum, 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 bum,
Oh, 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 Thank you all for coming. Of course. Thank okay, you let's have us. a toast. Yes, toast. To not killing anyone this time. Okay. 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 Maybe a little too soon. A little bit. Uh, to the six badass bitches. Oh, so good. How about six us? friends? Six friends. <laughs> to six friends. To six friends. Eye contact. No contact. Do I need a lawyer or something? Am I in trouble? No, I don't want to go to jail. Just walk me through everything that happened in there. Hey! <laughs> oh, you guys shut up. It's my favorite show. <laughs> it's not real. You know that, right? It's reality TV. <laughs> they have writers. How does that work? Writers. Reality. Okay, I'm not listening. It's real people acting real stupid. Mm -hmm. Perfect for Mel. Oh, come on. They get to be real celebrities. I mean, they get to be on TV, some on magazines, some even get to do movies. I mean, people care about them. How cool is that? Oh, I want to do that one, you know, with the obstacle course, where they get hit and fall in the water. Yeah, that would be so fun. You know, like those big balls knocking you over. You want to get paid to get knocked over by big balls? Sure. <laughs> So, does it have to be big balls, or could it be like a group of smaller balls? Mm -hmm. I don't know, whatever. How much would you charge to get hit in the face with these big balls? Like, per ball? I don't know. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> <It's> gross! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> All right, well, don't laugh. I mean, you know how much those stolen sex tapes make? God, stolen. They're not stolen. How do you know? Honey, because you can't sell a sex tape without the signed consent of the people in them. It's a business. They say these tapes are stolen, but it's just advertising. Whatever. Okay, that's a small price to pay for all of that. No way. No, it is not. No, you guys are telling me you wouldn't get paid $2.1 million <laughs> to do a porno? No. I'd bend over and take a horse for that. Totally. You see, Joey agrees with me. Yeah, but if I'm being timed, I might need to train a bit. <laughs> yeah, and see, I'm not the only crazy one. Okay, ladies, off you go. Go get drunk. <laughs> Joey and I have this. Oh my god, Mel totally believes you. Yeah, well, you guys were ganging up on her. Ugh. You know I've basically been like the father she never had since she was five. God, she loves that stuff. You know, she's gone on a few of those shows. Mm -hmm. um, you know, like interviews, talk shows, that sort of thing. Um, and some nightclubs even paid her to just go hang out. I mean, I got asked a couple of times, but, you know, after. Yeah. Yeah, I had agents and managers calling me. Really? Mm-hmm. They wanted to get the Rapist Killer 6 mm. on. Oh, my God. I don't even know what the point was. I don't even think that they knew. Of course not. And the last thing I want to do is hear about what happened over and over again. Okay, honey. Let's go get drunk. <laughs> oh, that's your boot. <laughs> hey, don't drink my sangria. Tim Buck says it's a cat video. No. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, where's Katie? She's on oh. the porch. Huh. <laughs> okay, oh, you guys, here it is, here it is. All right. You ready? This experience Thank changed you, you. I mean, whether it happened that night or... Boom, there it is. ...since that night. Angry tear. But do you have any regrets? Huh? What? Come on, you guys, angry tears. People love this shit. It's like, oh, is she sad? Is she mad? <gasps> no, she is mad. You know? <laughs> Many are saying that you're merely the face of a new generation of women. But do you see yourself as a hero? I think that I'm a hero in a way that I can inspire other women to stand up for themselves. Rape is something this? that is an ongoing 
Uh, I voted for Cassidy. It's not funny. Well, I would hope that I can just <gasps> Mel. You promised me. To fight back and to not... You said this goddamn hey. week, and we wouldn't talk about it. Joey, we're not talking about it. This is my real. My PR agent put it together. Okay. Your PR agent. Yes. What the fuck is wrong with oh you? My God, angry tears, Joey. Do you know how difficult that is to do? It's like a contrast or, or a uh, juxtaposition. <laughs> yes. Yes. It's not something that just anyone can do. It's a natural ability. It's a gift. Says who? My acting teacher. Okay. <laughs> Ellie, you promised me. Joey, I said I didn't want to come, but you said this weekend wouldn't be about it. Joe. No. Joey, listen to me. You can't keep doing this. We don't see you, never hear from you. It's like you were the one that died that night. I don't need this. You think any of us like living with this, with this looming over our heads? We never asked for this. Yeah, well, you're sitting around watching videos about it like it's, like it's a fucking old volleyball tournament. Okay, n number one, that is a terrible analogy, JoJo. And number two? No, no fucking two, Heather. I'm out of here. I didn't want to spend my time with you guys talking about it. It? It? You can't even say what it is. You can't even say what it is. Do you think you can heal like that? Hiding from it? Acting like everything's fine? Yeah, well, maybe I should drink a thousand fucking smoothies and smoke some weed. Will that make me feel better? Nice. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm sorry. This shit brings out the worst in me. We know, that's why we're all here. I can't eat. I can't sleep. So how do I get over that? Do we sit around eating cookie dough, doing each other's hair while we watch a Gilmore Girls marathon and reminisce about the time we heard a grown man cry like a little boy as a life slipped out of him? Tell me. I don't know, okay? Yeah, you don't know. No, I don't know, but we have to, we have to do this together. Why? Because. God, women don't stick together. What? In this country, women make up 55% of the population, but maybe 2% of the government. We could take over the world if we wanted to, but we don't, because we don't stick together. We are our own worst enemies. Men aren't holding us back. They don't have to because Shit. women turn on each other, they cut each other down, and it doesn't have to be that way. It doesn't. We could do anything. Even this, if we just fucking support each other, if we just stick together. Bitch. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> what, it was funny. <laughs> I don't need this. Joe. Joey, come on. <laughs> Joey, where are you going? Home. I don't want any part of this bullshit. <laughs> you don't have a car. All right, I'll call a cab. Where's your phone? You can't go. Why not? Because I see him. What? What did you say? I've seen him. Tyler. You, you see him? OK, that's not funny. Look, I'm not making this up. Please, please believe me. I have been to doctors. I have talked to professionals. I have talked to everyone. That's why I go on these shows. I want someone to help me. I think that talking about it will help me. But I still see him and no one cares anymore. If you are messing with me, I am going to be mad. I'm not. I'm not. I see him. Late at night, I look out my window. There he is. And he's just standing there in that mask. I mean, I turn on the flashlight, I call for help, and then he's gone. I've seen him too. Are you guys fucking with me? You are. Did you tell them? 
You told them. No, I didn't. This is a joke. I am going to beat your asses. She's seen him too. We both have. Always just out on the street. Late at night. It, it's hard to see him, but he's out there. With that mask. Guys, listen. We had a trauma, okay? A significant one. Stop trying to rationalize this. Fine. Mal, you're not crazy. Because I've seen him too. But it's to be expected. Expected. That we've all seen the same thing. A fucking dead rapist. That's expected for you. Well, no, but I'm just saying we had a traumatic experience and there's bound to be some sort of emotional echo. I guess I should feel better knowing everyone else has seen him. Not everybody. Joe? If you have, we should know. I mean, I guess if it was just a few of us, it could just be our own issues. You know, mine's playing tricks, but if it was all of us, all six, you have to tell us. Joey, tell me you haven't seen him. Tell me right now and I will let it go. Because I think you have. Joey, have you seen Tyler? Joe! No. My God, you're lying. was a mistake. I'm going to bed. You can take me home in the morning.
goodness. <laughs> you look stupid. What do you want? I just, I need a tissue. I'm all sweaty. Okay. You oh. here. What was that? Just Heather, she's acting stupid. That good night sounded really forced. Like you didn't really mean it. No, I really meant it. Well, I don't want a good night that's forced. It totally defeats the purpose. Mm. Honey, I really, really, really meant it. Melissa, you're the actress now. Did Sahara really mean it? Hello? Melissa? Well, I preferred the term thespian. Okay, in your lesbian opinion. Thespian. <laughs> Okay, in your expertise, did Sahara's good night sound like she really meant it? I don't know, I think that she needs a stronger moment before, like maybe some improv or... Hey, Sahara! Did you hear that? Melissa says you need some improv! Yes, I heard her. Oh my god, this is not helping me fall asleep. Oh my god! <laughs> good night, bitches! Why are you always calling women bitches? Yeah! <laughs> I was gonna say the same thing. I don't know, uh, because it's funny, <laughs> it's demeaning. To who? To bitchy people. <laughs> I would never call you guys bitches if you were actually bitches. Like I can't. Call Sahara Kinkles? <laughs> <laughs> what? Exactly. <laughs> you bitch! <laughs> now you're using that term in a demeaning way. Yeah, I know! <gasps> well, I am totally Wait. offended. So if you don't mean it, then you can say it. You can say it with love and affection, yes. Okay. Bitches. Okay, so like, I can call Joey uh, Little Miss Sunshine? <laughs> exactly. Or Happy Pants? What about uh, Giggles? All of those are good. I hear you, bitches. Hey. Don't say bitches. It's demeaning! Only to bitches! Sleep! Oh my God, go to bed! Okay, okay, okay. Sahara! <laughs> Good night! Good night. See, that one I really believed. Good night. Good night. Katie. Katie, come on. Katie. Stop it. It's not funny. Katie. Really, that's not funny at all. I already feel sick. Honey, what? I just heard something. Heard what? Somebody telling me to run. Annie, no, you were just dreaming. Okay?
I don't know. See, I told you. I told you somebody's doing this. Doing what? I don't know. It's not funny. What's going on? Are you okay? Yeah, I, I jumped up too fast. The room's spinning a bit. Hey, guys. Where is everyone? Katie's in your room, right? Yeah. Did Mel go look? I don't know. I, I think so. I was sleeping. Okay. Mel? Mel? Why are you whispering? Because... If there is a bad guy here, I don't think we're sneaking up on him. Okay. Well, I'm open to suggestions. Hey, motherfucker! There are six of us and one of you, and yeah, maybe the big bad man might take one of us down, but I shit you not that at least one of us is gonna rip a few new holes inside of you. Nice. Bitch! <laughs> hey. <laughs> Fuck. It's fine. Yeah, it was just the screen door. I mean, the door was bolted, but the wind cut the screen and slammed it. Oh. Okay. That's a big ass door. Are you okay, honey? Mm. I thought I was freaking out. What do you mean, freaking out? It's fine. Okay. I'm gonna make some tea. You want some? No, thanks. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go back to bed. All right. Good night. Good night. Good night. to me, okay? Mel, we all saw him, all right? We're not crazy, okay? Someone is just messing with us. Mel, I need you to give me the knife, okay? Come on. It's okay, Mel. 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 She's gonna hurt Just herself. let it go, honey. It's Come okay. on, Mel. Mel. Come on. It's okay, <laughs> it's okay darling. It's okay, darling. Honey, no. Okay, okay, got it. Honey? Joey? Your neighbors, do you know them? Are there any assholes, anyone that knows about us, about what happened? You think it was neighbors? I don't know, so I'm asking. Mel, think, honey, okay. Did you tell anyone that we'd be here this weekend? Anyone at all, anyone who might want to mess with us? Darling? No! Okay, and what about your neighbors? Do you know them? I don't have any neighbors for 30 miles. Okay, what about the... The house next door, honey. It's empty. Katie! I'm out of here. Look, I don't know if you guys are fucking with me, but it's not funny and I'm not staying here. 
Leaving? Joey was right. This was a mistake. I mean, what was I thinking? Coming out here to can't rape my face. Ha! Huh? <sighs> Whatever. Katie, look, you can't go out there. Why? Because! Because no one would stay in a dark cabin in the woods with a psycho and a mask lurking outside? I'd rather take my chances in LA where there's people with guns. Lots and lots of guns. Hey. Katie! Wait, honey. Sorry, Mel. Fuck your cabin. No bad guys. And Tyler? Fuck you and your little baby dick, you motherfucking coward! Wow. Yeah. Just... Wow. Good for her. I'm gonna get my keys. I call shotgun. No, come on, get, get your stuff, we're out of here. I'm not gonna die in the woods like some hillbilly. Seventy miles per hour, dick face. <sighs> what the hell? No, 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 no! I filled you up. No, 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 no! Stay there in that house together in a group. Shit. Shit. They're not coming. Mel? 
I'll send your mom flowers. Let's go! Look at me, okay? I need you to stick around. We need you for this. Just stop, okay? Just, she, she needs to snap out of this. Why? So she can freak out like the rest of us? She's in shock, okay? We need to get her to a hospital. Give her a minute! Jar? What about you? Are you okay? Can you hear me? I can hear you. Are you okay? No. We need to figure out what we're gonna do. We're gonna kill him. Him. Yeah, Sahara, it's him. You're just gonna assume it's him? Yeah. That doesn't make sense, honey! Okay, I'm gonna assume that it's him. I'm gonna assume that some stranger didn't just come in here and shish kebab our friend, okay? Okay. I'm gonna assume that it's the same guy that we stabbed a hundred times, okay? I'm gonna assume that it's the guy that I personally took a knife and jammed it up his dick hole. Is it okay with you if I make that assumption? But how can it be him? How is that possible? It doesn't matter. I don't care if he lived. He came back, if it's his twin, a copycat. Sad little man next door looking for attention. I don't even care if it's a demon coming back as him. He killed Katie. And now I'm killing him. Again, wow. That's great. And I feel all empowered. I feel really super woman's libby. But I would prefer that we carry on this conversation in a place that has more than some, some, some ugly ass family photos to use as weapons. Good idea. Okay. Let's go. No, no, you saw what he did to Katie. Look no, at her, no, 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 why did she come back? Why did she come back? He's out there, he'll get her. She's no, no. Just stay together, no. just stay together. No. No. But what about Katie? We can't just leave her here like this. We'll come back with the police. Mel, you can either walk out or get carried out. Your call. So oh good. Clear. You sure? Yeah. Okay, good enough for me. Guys, come on, let's go. Wait, Sahara, Mom. stay with Mel. Heather comes with me. Joe, you keep being you. One, two, three. Let's take my car. No, it's more expensive. Seriously. It's closer. Please. <laughs> <laughs> 
Fuck, I drained us. No gas. That's why Katie came back. She had no <sighs> gas. What? Something's wrong. No. Do you see him too? It was him? I, I, I don't know what it was. It was moving so fast, my God, it was coming for me. I didn't see him. Oh, no. First we kill Tyler, then the cell phone guy. I swear. We can't stay. Oh, really? The back door, it was open. It was locked when we left. He got in. He was out front. I don't know. Every time I blinked, he was there. He, he moved so fast. Mal, you saw him too, right? I didn't see him. He was there. That wasn't Tyler. That was something else. Look, I don't want to hear it, all right? Why? Because you know what we've done? Yeah. We're being punished for what we did. Stop. No. We deserve this for what we did. For what we did. What do you mean? To him. I mean, we could have just cut him, hurt him, scared him off, maybe. You can't start second guessing, okay? It was a bad night. We were tripping. Oh, God. I know what I did. You guys can fight this if you want. There's a rifle upstairs. But I'm not helping. I know what I did. I know that I deserve this. I'm going upstairs to wait for him. No, no. We stay together. He could be up there. No, I'm done. She's lost it. No! Where's the gun? Upstairs in my room. break into the neighbors and use their phone to call the cops. Good plan. Okay. Okay, but, but we go together. Okay, nothing stupid. No one goes alone. We can't take them out. Maybe we can? We'd have to carry her. We cannot leave her. I'll stay. No. I feel really nauseous. Suddenly I feel sick, I feel really dizzy. I'll be fine. Okay. 
Here, you take the knife. Okay. Right? Now I want you to watch from Sahara's room and let us know if you see him, okay? Okay. Alright, I promise. Okay. Well, sweetheart, I'll be right down the hall, okay? Just, just yell. Okay? Did you hear Heather? She's gonna be right down the hall and we'll be right back. Okay? Lock the door behind us. Lock the door behind us. Okay? Rubbing your hands. So, so are they numb or something? Can we talk about this later? Does that happen before? What? Shut up! Shh. Oh my god. What? What is it? What is it? Back! 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 What's wrong? Are you okay? Oh, oh shit. We've been drugged. Go get the knife. Go get the knife from heaven. Wait, back! Back! Give me the gun! I got you. I got you. I'm not gonna let you go. I'm not gonna let you go. Hang on. I got you. Okay? Come on. Mel, we gotta go. Something's really wrong. Mel, get up! I'm so tired. Mel, Mel, get up. We gotta go. Come on, get up. Come on, sweet. I can't leave you here. What is wrong with you?
there, it hurt. I need my knife. Okay. 
Again, bitch. She always ruins everything. Everything. I mean, my reveal was supposed to be so good. Melissa. Joe, I'm pissed. I mean, I had this all planned out. I was gonna be like, oh, we did it. And you were gonna be like, oh my God. And we were gonna have this whole best friend bonding shit. <laughs> you know what, I'm over it. It's fine. I guess. I'm just pissed because I wanted to do the whole trio thing. You really need three. You've got to have two hot ones and an ugly one. She was going to be our snaggletooth. I don't understand. Okay, like you're the hot and brooding one, I'm the hot and fun one, and she was going to be the gross one that made us look better. <laughs> She's not gross. <laughs> well, she is now. 
I mean, don't get me wrong, she was gonna go anyway, but I was thinking more of a season one cliffhanger. But this, this is really kind of a waste. <laughs> you did all this. You did all of this to us. You, you drugged the drinks so that we would see Tyler and freak out. Wow. <laughs> Amazing, Joey. Now, okay, I know you totally have a ton of questions. <sighs> no questions? None? <laughs> Weird. Because it doesn't matter. That's right. It doesn't matter. It is all about the destination, not the journey. It doesn't matter what you have to do to get there. Joey, I knew that you were just like me. I knew when we were talking about reality TV and the sex tapes and you said you would do a porn for money, I knew right then and there I had made the right choice. I knew you understand how this industry works and that you were thinking the same way I was. No, never. You said you would do a porn for money, would do anything, like even a horse or something. I was kidding, Mel. Why would you do that? That is fucked up. <sighs> this? Don't worry, Joey. This is totally a Heather thing. I'm not going to use this on you. <laughs> Katie got knives in the back. Sahara got torched. Becca. <laughs> Becca was a little different. That bitch hit me on the head with a whiskey bottle. But you know what? I improvised. Improv classes, they always teach you yes and. So I went with it. Yes, I really did think of everything. I always think of everything. Okay, that I didn't think of. But shit, that was hot. God, you know what? We should do that again for the camera. Hold on, I have my phone here. I'm leaving and I'm calling the cops. I don't want to kill you, Mel. I know you don't, Joey. I really did think of everything, didn't I, Joey? And if you started being all whiny, sad, Joe, I thought, oh, that's perfect. She just ODs on painkillers. I mean, it makes perfect sense. After that night, you just couldn't get past it. You just couldn't move on. So you turned to drugs to numb the pain. Mmm, mm, that makes for such a good story. Easy to believe with how you withdrew from us and how you stayed out of the limelight. Hmm. God, that is such a good story. How you had something to hide. And then you just snapped. Hmm.
please help me. Please, you gotta help me. She's lost her mind. She, she killed everyone. Yes. I'll be here. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh God, it's horrible. My friends, everyone's gone. I'm making this tape just in case I don't survive. So that everyone can know what really happened. And everyone can know me, the real me. Joey, she killed everyone. She thought she killed me. She's never been the same since the night we fought off the rapist. I mean, how many people does this have to happen to? What, what is it about me that makes this just so... so... enough. <sighs> hey, Joey. That shit you injected me with? Get a tolerance to it. Wait a second, you're an addict? <laughs> That's perfect, because I just made that up for the show. <laughs> Yeah, you stop seeing your friends, your family, but it takes the pain away. And that's the important part. Joey, listen to me. This can be just like it was before. God, I wanted to forget so bad. And I tried, I tried, Mel. I tried three times. I tried three times to overdose. But I didn't use enough. Neither did you. Joey, remember? Remember before? We had everybody wanting to interview us. Everyone wanted to talk to us. We had all this attention that, that was just for one guy. Imagine what we would get for all of this. Oh my God, we would have our own show in seconds. Seconds flat, Joey. I changed my mind. I do want to kill you. <sighs> well, it's not loaded. No shit. Joey, Joey. Really? Do you really think you have a chance against me? Do you really think you can take me? I've killed five people already. Five. I don't give a fuck if I live. You psychotic.
to me. I want uh, fucking no. Let them do me. What? What did you want to say? <laughs> what, Mel? I really want to hear it. You were right. I need this. You, you survived last year's awful tragedy. And now you've written a book the Sixth Friend. In it, you mention that you even managed to learn something from that, that terrible tragedy. What Melissa did, her desperation, her selfishness, I can never forgive. But it gave me something, a reason to live. And I'm just happy that I have a chance to share my story of hope with others. <laughs> Josephine Taylor, thank you. And be sure to watch her long road to recovery as she navigates the dating world in her new show, starting Thursday nights at 8 p.m this week.